To be like Jesus, Advent message to sanctify body and soul. Beloved, I wish above all things that thou mayest prosper and be in health, even as thy soul prospereth. 3 John 2 God purpose for his children is that they shall grow up to the full stature of men and women in Christ. In order to do this, they must use aright every power of mind, soul and body they cannot afford to waste any mental or physical strength the question of how to preserve the health is one of primary importance when we study this question in the fear of god we shall learn that it is best for both our physical health and our spiritual advancement to observe simplicity in diet let us patiently study this question we need knowledge and judgment in order to move wisely in this matter. Nature's law are not to be resisted, but obey. Those who have received instruction regarding the evils of the use of flesh meats, tea and coffee, and rich and unhealthful food preparation, and who are determined to make a covenant with God by sacrifice, will not continue to indulge their appetite for food that they know to be unhelpful. God demands that the appetite be cleansed and that self-denial be practiced in regard to those things which are not good. This is a work that will have to be done before his people can stand before him in perfect people. The remnant people of God must be a converted people. The presentation of this message is to result in the conversion and sanctification of souls. We are to feel the power of the Spirit of God in this movement. This is a wonderful, definite message. It means everything to the receiver, and it is to be proclaimed with a loud cry. We must have a true abiding faith that this message will go forth with increasing importance till the close of time. A solemn responsibility rests upon those who know the truth that all their works shall correspond with their faith and that their lives shall be refined and sanctified and they be prepared for the work that must rapidly be done in these closing days of the message. They have no time or strength to spend in indulgence of appetite. The words should come to us now with impelling earnestness. Repent and be converted, that your sins may be blotted out when the times of refreshing shall come from the presence of the Lord. To be like Jesus, October 10th. As for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. Thank you all for listening, and please join us once again tomorrow for your daily devotional reading. God bless.